Also, what happened about, uh, well, we had uh, Dance for the Champs uh, on my show two weeks ago to talk about the event and to promote it. And uh, uh, Paul Wachewski, who fills in for me when I'm on vacation sometimes, Paul was in the studio when it happened, or he was listening when it happened, and uh, he made the comment, he said that if my producer, Cam, would get up there and dance, that he would make a donation for $500. Yeah. Now the problem was that uh, there was no time for Cam to actually you know, get involved in the competition, have the classes and all of that, and actually learn to dance. Uh, secondly, uh, the problem was that, uh, quite honestly, even if he did, he'd still suck. So, um, <laughs> but he's been very generous uh, to be able to uh, come out here and uh, go out and dance and uh, enjoy himself and maybe embarrass himself a little bit, have a good time, and raise $500 for Youth Emergency Services. So please give a nice warm round of applause and vote for him up there for my producer, Cam Broham. Yeah! <laughs> Considering this looks like my college dorm room, with all the smoke in here, I think it went off pretty well. So was that worth the $500 donation? Yes, it was. I was, I was glad to do it, glad to be a part of this. I thank everybody for, uh, for putting up with me. Thank um, you. Obviously, you didn't have quite the opportunity to lobby with the online voting, so here's your opportunity now to appeal to all of these fine people. If you can see them through the smoke, We started the trend. All clean, good fun. Good fun. So here's your chance to lobby for some votes in your bucket there. Um, hey, vote for me, guys. <laughs> okay, now I'm taking that five back because I have to buy a beer. And mine was from Kayla. Well, mine was from Kayla, so I don't have any money on me. I'm not gonna lie. I have to buy Heidi a beer. <laughs> but, we'll, but we'll get you some larger bills after this. Um, We'll save Tom for last on this one. Andy, yeah. what are your marks? I didn't realize I was supposed to be judging on this one, so I was just <laughs> kind of... Anyway, um, what, what the heck were you, were you shoveling? Were you shoveling? Okay, I, I just thought that was... Uh, okay, I didn't know that, the spring movie, the shoveling. It's just awesome that you would actually get up there and do that in front of all these people. Oh on purpose. <laughs> Wow, that's pretty brave. Um, I will give you a 10 for doing that. <laughs> Cynthia, we got some love for the white boy rhythm. Absolutely, I thought it was inspired. I could see where you were coming from. I felt the message. Um, it was very clear to me. Um, that was amazing, amazing. Aaron. Um, I've been to many of these and I thought I was at a Justin Timberlake concert at that time. <laughs> You were moving just like JT. Well done. Bring a sexy back. All right. All right, Tom, I can't wait. I cannot wait. Well, first of all, I happen to have the check here, and there's not a chance in hell I'm giving it to you uh, the way that they did. Um, but uh, I got to say, I really do appreciate Cam uh, for doing this, okay? Yeah. I really do. I really do appreciate that. Um, uh, I, I just wish he'd put that much effort into working at the show. It'd be nice. Um, 
But uh, seriously, Cam, of uh, all the uh, answers that I saw here tonight, yeah, you were one of them. Um, <laughs> I've, I've, I've never seen the running man done standing still. But anyway, uh, thanks for being a part of it. And of course, I gotta give you a, I gotta give you a 10 just for uh, showing up. You bet, thanks. All right, let's clap it out. Give him a nice little rhythm as he exits the stage. Here we go. Pump up the jam. Here we go. Exiting. You're yeah, in you style. Exit. Exiting in style. Right. Here we go. White boy rhythm. Let's 